Chase for your dreams, shoot for the stars, though hard it may seem. Welcome to Milo Sports Clinic Online. I am Coach Sophia of the Best Center Sports Volleyball Team. Before we start, I encourage the supervision of your parents or guardians to accompany you all throughout this training. Also, I encourage the parents to join to make this training meaningful. Milo in the Best Center conducted this online training for you to be the best by being active, fit, and healthy, and at the same time, enjoy the sport you love. From week 1, we learned the basic receiving stance and its importance. Week 2, we learned ball control. And from week 3, we learned the testing of hitting power and the timing of hitting the ball. So for this week, we are going to summarize everything you have done for the past weeks by doing the receiving stance with ball or with partner. Our training is divided into five. The warm-up, the dynamics, drills, conditioning, and the cool down. So ready your water bottles and towels? Let's go! Before going to strenuous activities like volleyball, let's start by doing warm-up. For two sets, we will do jumping jacks for 20 seconds, then rest for 10 seconds. You may start slowly, then gradually increasing your speed to allow your body to work out. Now we're done with warm-up, let's proceed with dynamics. Dynamics is important, especially in volleyball, because it stretches your muscles. Volleyball uses almost all of your muscles, so doing dynamics can prevent cramps or injuries. Do it correctly and explosively as you can for 10 seconds for each move. Our first dynamics is arm rotation. Extend your arms sidewards, shoulder level with palms up. First, arms rotating forward. After 10 seconds, rotating backwards for 10 seconds also. Ready? Let's start! Backwards, ready, go! Good job! Next is hip rotation. Feet apart, as wide as your shoulders, arms at the waist. First, hips rotating clockwise. Then after, Counter Ready? Let's go! Make sure your back leg is straight, 
toes are pointing forward, then your front knees don't go beyond your toes. Then, step back, other leg, same procedure. Ready? Let's start! with the wall. If you don't have enough wall or free wall to do the drills, you can do it with a partner. So this drill requires patience and discipline especially for beginners. So do it correctly and consistently so that you can get it right. So let's go! Let's start! First drill is self volley and big pass forward. First, with the knowledge of the receiving stance, Start with the right leg forward, then make sure you have enough space away from the wall. Okay? The next, the next, throw the ball towards the wall, then the body will be forward, then back. Okay? So do it for at least 10 times. You can do it one at a time, or if, if you can do it, you can do it uh, continuously. But uh, if you're a beginner, I prefer that you do it uh, one at a time. And after that, have your leg with the left foot forward. Then same procedure. Throw the ball towards the wall. The ball will be just forward and back. Okay? Let's start. When you fall, be better than the
Chase for your dreams, shoot for the stars, though hard it may seem, no matter how far. Find the power that's within, it's inside you, let it out. You have what it takes. What it takes to win Run away from any doubt Find the strength In your heart There is nothing Another reminder guys Focus on the form Stay low And make sure your arms are extended while doing the drills Okay, let's start with the next drill Next is the pass forward so a while ago, we've done self valley and dig pass forward. This time, it is only dig pass forward. So, removing the self valley, start with your right leg forward, right foot forward, then throw the ball towards the wall, then dig pass forward, and catch it. Okay? Same with dig pass prog progression, you may do it first with one dig pass, then catch, then two dig passes, then catch, then three dig passes and then catch. Okay? So let's start with one dig pass, then two two dig passes, and then three dig passes. Let's go! Don't give up. And just stay strong. Set your sides and just aim high. Get up, get up, get up. Get up. Last drill is continuous dig pass. From progression, from one dig pass, two dig pass, three dig pass, you will do this time, you will do it continuously. Okay? So for this drill, I recommend that you find one point on the wall and focus on that. Okay? So that the ball won't go anywhere else. And then, um, another thing, the power that you apply on the wall will go back to, back towards you. So control your power. Okay? So let's start. There is nothing you can't achieve until the end. From the start, trust yourself and just believe. Get up, get up, get up. Previously, we have done mountain climbers. For this week, we're gonna do burpees. So let's go! Feet apart, align with your shoulders. Then, bend your knees a little. Place your hands on the floor. Then, kick your legs straight behind. Then, hop back. 
back into your body, then jump straight up the air with your arms straight. Then go back to your normal position. Okay? So do it for 10 times for one set. So let's start. Don't forget 
to like our page, The Best Center Sport Inc. Like, share, and subscribe this video. Again, be the best by staying fit, active, healthy, safe, and drink your mind.